I guess to be successful you've got to constantly try and push your own ideas forward do you know what I mean mm -hmm. it's about your vision it's about your direction and your stamp that you want to put on the world or you know or on your craft or your art and that's my mission more than anything else you know I guess it's similar for yourself right? totally you know I, I was busy looking at sort of Henri Cartier-Bresson who's the, the god of street photography mm. and sort of you know, wanting to cap capture people jumping over puddles and, mm. and things like that and then you realise he's got the best yeah. jumping over puddle yeah. picture there, there it is yeah. so why bother mm. I mean I became very interested in the ideas of time and this idea of modernism's kind of nostalgia for the future so this yeah. kind of projection from then into our time now mm. this kind of idea of this is how we would be living. Do, you, do you imagine that when you see these buildings, they're like failed buildings? Or do you imagine that, you know, because they're projections into the future, we've actually failed them? Uh, I think it's both things. Some of those buildings failed, and I think there's something very poignant about that because they had very high ideals, you know. And then, in some respects, we failed some of those buildings by not either looking after them or not really just being, you know, those people were kind of way ahead in some ways. Yeah. And, you know, maybe some. Some of that stuff, some of, especially the architecture, I think, is being revitalised mm. now. You know, people are able to build with concrete in that way. Yeah. You know, Zaha Hadid or something would be somebody that has really picked up the baton in many ways. But, yeah, I think it's both. There have been moments over the last eight years where I've thought, man, if I packed this in, what would I do? Mm. Do you find and that spurs you on? Yeah. Right. Yeah, because... The absence of, a, of an The absence of a plan B. <laughs> For me, I just wanted to work in music and like, I never really thought of anything else except when I was like... That big. So go and tell me, what was it? Like a wizard. <laughs> <laughs> a wizard? <laughs> when I was really little, that's what I wanted to be. I thought that was a legitimate career choice. <laughs>